So the CML skill set is uh, really expanding pretty dramatically. So, um, you know, there's certainly uh, messaging matters more than ever. Uh, competitors are able to quickly uh, copy what you do, uh, both in software, messaging on the website. We have competitors who are crawling every day through our website. They're on the West Coast, and I know on the East Coast that at 3 o'clock I can watch my competitors come on my website, what pages they go to. So, um, you know, messaging is, is really key. I think uh, CMOs um, have to be very agile and not be very rigid. So I remember starting my career when we had actually annual marketing plans. You know, I have an annual budget, but I'm adjusting it all the time. What works, what doesn't work. You have a new entrant, you have a new opportunity, you're pivoting something here. So I think agility. Uh, sometimes I've seen CMOs from very large companies that are used to annual planning cycles uh, really flounder because they don't have that ability to sense new things and make changes. They're very, very rigid. So I think this idea of uh, moving quickly, sensing, uh, moving into new areas is, is kind of a key skill. And the other one increasingly is being very comfortable with data. So uh, marketers are sitting on tons of data and the best marketers are really taking advantage of it and really um, uh, creating action plans around that data. They interpret it. I, I think what I look for in, in marketing leadership is curiosity that marketers are asking the right questions. They're curious about what's going on in the market. They see something that doesn't make sense, they ask what's happening here, why? The other attribute that I think is very important is being comfortable with mistakes. And so there's some marketers whose DNA is that we will not make mistakes, they don't tolerate that, and I think you have to sort of let that go and really learn from your mistakes. So um, I, I love to really uh, be involved in cultures that are about um, sensing things very quickly, being very agile, uh, not being afraid to try new things. If it works great, we'll double down. And if it doesn't work, we'll move into some other area, but really learning and be very transparent about what works and what doesn't.